guys, Rob here at Bob Evans Classics. If you want to see all of our new inventory every week, please hit that subscribe button. We get new cars in daily. Hit the like button. Appreciate you checking us out. Let's go. What is up, guys? Rob here at Bob Evans Classics. We are doing a little different today. We are doing a lot walk, not our normal warehouse walk. We're doing our project walk. These are all cars that are coming up that our guys are working on that will be at the warehouse once they're ready, unless you want to buy it as is. Please leave me a comment on the type of cars you want me to buy. Leave a comment right now. Subscribe. Appreciate you guys. All right, guys. We got this beautiful, and when I say beautiful, it's a funky, cool Lincoln Continental with the suicide doors. This thing is solid. It may look like it's got rust here, but it's not. It's just surface. This car stood in the garage for years, about 40 years. We got it to the shop. We went through it, got it running and driving. It runs, it drives. I'm thinking about just throwing clear coat on it with this cool patina. Undercarriage is perfect. It has no rot at all on the whole car. Just surface. Came from out west. I think a nice clear coat and then we'll put it up for sale. If you're interested in the way it is as is, let me know. I probably take the way it sits running and driving 12 grand for it. I think once we put the clear on it, put the wheels back in, change the windshield, we'll put it up for, I don't know, 15, 16 grand. Then I got this Mustang here, 66. It's got AC, pony interior, blew the engine in it. So we're throwing a new engine in it. This one will be coming up. It's going to be mid 20s when it's ready. We bought it, had a head gasket problem, overheated the engine. So we got a new engine ordered, ready to go in it. Then we got this Chevelle here. Chevelle's got a 350 under the hood, powered by a four speed manual transmission. Tranny was making a little noise. Got the tranny out, doing a rebuild on the tranny, then it will be up for sale. This one's gonna be up for around 30 when it's ready. Sixty-seven, I believe. And we got a 73 Nova. Runs and dries. We gotta replace the gas tank in this. This thing's gonna be cheap. It's got a 350 under the hood. You're looking at probably 12.5 on this one when it's ready. As is, I don't know, 11.5. Just got to throw a gas tank in it. Not a huge deal. Then we got the 68 Camaro. That's We put a brand new engine in it. Did a bunch of work mechanically. This thing is such mechanical sound. But the body's not beautiful. So we're going to send this out to get paint. It, mechanically, everything's been redone on this. Engine, transmission power steering, the lines, brake lines, the brakes all the way around, carburetor. We're gonna throw this out to paint and make it a nice car. Now this one's probably gonna be 40, 50 grand when it's all done. This is gonna be a real, real heavy hitter. Then we got this BMW here coming up for sale. Gotta do little odds and ends to it, 325i. Gotta get that window back window in, fix the interior up. It's gonna be mid-teens. And we got a 67 Fastback GTA, not a GTA, I'm sorry, just an automatic transmission. Uh, 289 under the hood, waiting on a carburetor for it. This car will be mid 40s when it's ready. 67 Fastback. And we got the 69 Fastback. This car. It's got a four speed 302 under the hood. Just waiting for the striping kit to come in. We're going to make it a boss clone. It's going to be mid 40s. Grabber blue. And then we got this one owner Malibu SS 65. Three speed. Needs paint. It's solid, but the paint is bad. I'll probably sell it as is for. Mm, 16.5 with paint's gonna be mid 20s. And we got this RS here waiting for ignition for it. Once the ignition gets installed, it'll be up for sale. 68. This is gonna be mid 30s. It's a true RS. Driver quality. And 
Then we got a BMW M3, needs a transmission. I'll take 10 grand as it sits. It's an SMG. We've got a Porsche that doesn't start right now, but it's only got 60,000 miles. I bought it from a client of Drove Perfect, got it here, and we went to start it and haven't been able to get it started. Haven't had time to go through it. Take 10 the way it sits. I don't think it needs much to get it going. Guys, finally, they got these two puppies over here to end out our day. 55 Chrysler Windsor convertible. Needs a carburetor. As is, I would take 6,500. Once we fix it, it's going to be 12 or 13 grand. And then we got this MG, which I don't have a title for it. I will take best offer on it. I got a bill of sale. I believe it's like a 57. The engine's there. It's all intact. It was sitting in a garage for years. Make me an offer. And we'll get it out of here, guys. All right, guys, that's it. That is our lot walk, project walk. If you're interested in these projects, let me know. Leave me a comment if you want to see more project walks. This is a quick video. Just wanted to show you what we got up and coming on the block that will be headed to the warehouse, guys. I appreciate you checking out our page. God bless the USA. Take care, guys.